Hello everyone, welcome to the Showcase channel. Uh, we have here today another uh, BGS submission uh, pickup. And it is a pretty good one. I hope that everyone is having a good Labor Day weekend. Hopefully everyone gets to take off um, on Monday. And that is, uh, today's only Saturday, so yeah. Um, anyways, I guess let's, let's just get right into it. Um, as you can see, I've got a bunch of uh, packs here. This is all, I'm going to make this like one like super video after this. Um, hopefully, um, just the miscellaneous packs, uh, baseball, football, basketball, and, uh, yeah, I guess stay tuned for that and subscribe for more, but this BGS, uh, pickup video is, uh, gonna be a pretty good one, so, uh, I guess let's, let's, let's get right into it. <coughs> As I like to call it, brown bag episode. Okay, so I don't know on a particular order. Um, let me look and see how I want to do this because I think I'm going to do the one that I probably like the most, that I was most surprised about um, in the back. And then the lowest grade up at the front. All right. Got six cards. Um, I dropped off five more. Uh, be sure and subscribe to check out how that one's going to turn out. All Jordan inserts going to be on my next pickup. I dropped off five more. This is a six today. So uh, Beckett went up on their um, their submission uh, prices. Um, both both for uh, or I guess just for cards. So I think they went up a few dollars per. So um, anyways, yeah, let's check this out and. Uh, I guess if you guys want to uh, see a top 10 or, you know, a top 10 like baseball, top 10 football of like, you know, the graded cards that I have or ungraded cards, I suppose, just post in the comment section down below. I've never done one before and I'm, uh, I'm getting close to uh, my third box or I'm getting close to filling, I guess, two boxes of the graded um boxes they're pretty big like I don't know if, it, if any of you, if anyone has ever seen a graded card box like how you're supposed to store them but they're pretty big they're probably like a foot and a half in length I think <coughs> maybe 24 inches maybe two feet so anyways here we go I guess I'll uh, talk and show at the same time we've got here a real nice uh, card this card actually goes for a lot more than I thought. So, um, this is uh, Michael Jordan. I had to send a Michael Jordan insert in with this lot. So, Michael Jordan 1996 um, SPX Gold is the die cut. Um, lowest grade was Surface and it got an 8.5. Um, overall grade is a mint 9. So, that's a pretty nice card. Um, actually goes for yeah, like I said, a lot more than I thought. It's about a, over a hundred dollar card there. I think even over one fifty. Um, edges they gave me a nine, and then the other grades got nine fives. So surface got me an eight five. It looks like there's actually now looking at it. It looks like there's a really faint, which only if you were to send this in to get graded, they would be able to tell. But there's like a faint like swoosh over the bottom of the card and it just looks like it's on the front so <coughs> pretty nice card SPX gold alright we've got here a real nice one um, all the rest of them are gonna be all uh, pretty decent grades um, we've got uh, Kyrie Irving Um, 2012-13 uh, Rookie Limited um, out of 199 the autograph got a 9 so that is going to affect the overall uh, sell value it is the clear acetate version it's a grade 9.5 on the card autograph got a 9 there is a, a crease 
or something they said that went across the autograph is what the guy said somewhere some type of uh, fadedness or uh, something that went across the auto that made it go down so this one I was actually pretty excited to get um, so I don't know on what the overall sell value on this one would be but uh, it's out of 199 rookie auto um, it doesn't have the rookie or the RC on it but uh, it's from 1213 so um, out of 199 on card auto um, 95 edges or were a 9 on this one so I was hoping to get a 10 on this on this card in particular actually because of the acetate usually acetate cards get either nine fives or tens <coughs> that's usually uh, what I come across on that so uh, these are all basketball um, I'm pretty sure so uh, yeah, all basketball alright this one is a beauty here this is probably uh, one that I was expecting to get a nine five on and ended up did getting a nine five so um, the corners actually uh, took it down. I probably could have gotten a 10 um, if the corners would have been 0.5. So it's just 0.5 away from a 10. Um, Giannis Antetokounmpo, Antetokounmpo uh, 10 auto, which was a perfect centering on the autograph. Um, it's non-numbered, two 10 subgrades, and corners got a nine. So um, prestigious premieres real nice card here for Giannis uh, this is my first uh, rookie auto to obtain from this guy right here so I picked this card up probably uh, I think last year sometime whenever he was like blowing up really big <coughs> whenever I started to notice his uh, his improvements in the game and uh, yeah I picked that card up ho uh, intentionally hoping to grade it so all right, we've got another one from 1213, uh, Dream on Green. Uh, it's non-numbered. I think this is from uh, Crusade. Yes, it is from Crusade. Uh, subgrades are three nine fives with a 10. Autograph is a 10, really nice clean auto. Uh, Quest autographs, just the base version. <coughs> Not too pricey of a card, but uh, a good key, uh, good key card to have in your collection. You know, as the Warriors, uh, I guess if they win more championships, you know, the card will, you know, obviously increase. So it's not a good. It's a good card to keep or hold on to to see what happens in the future. Still pretty young player. All of these guys are pretty young players. There's only a couple veterans. So we got three nine fives so far: Giannis, uh, Draymond, and Kyrie. All pretty uh, next gen players or this generation players. All right, this card here is a non autograph, but a real, uh, real nasty card. Some of you guys that have been with my channel for a long time remember this card whenever I pulled it um, from the box that I pulled it from. Um, if you haven't seen that one, go back and check out uh, the video on that. Really nice, uh, Devin Booker rookie uh, dual patch uh, tools of the trade from absolute 2015 and it's numbered out of 25 dual patch real nice card real clean card <coughs> it would have been that much better obviously if it was autographed but I thought with the two nasty patches that it has and with his stuff like blowing up around the time that I pulled it and it's numbered out of 25 after uh, looking over it pretty well, I took a shot at it, so I was real surprised uh, that it got a 9.5, but hey, I'm really happy with that grade, so still, it's a really, uh, really awesome card. Uh, subgrades are, um, corners got me a 9, it was .5 away, it looks like, from, uh, from a 10, I think. Um, two 10s, a 9 and a 9.5, corners got me a 9. It's going to be the top left corner. You can't see it on the camera, obviously, but still a really nice overall overall grade. I really like this card. The two patches are really, really sweet. I generally don't grade just 
I guess there are some plain jersey cards that I have in my graded collection, but uh, yep, so uh, all right, so I saved the best for last. And I guess if you want to fast forward it and not hear me talk, but uh, the next card is just a really just icing on the cake for this overall like crazy pickup. I would have been really happy with just all of this, but uh, the next card I did was totally unexpected. Um, I sent it in just free willing it, and I didn't. Um, I don't know. I don't really have any words to explain it. It's not a 10, it's a 9.5 Jim Mint grade. Just a really surprising uh, overall grade. The, the corners on it, whenever I looked at it before I was going to send it in, threw me off because one of them had a bend. But the bend for the corner was on the back of the card. And I don't know if they didn't catch it because it's white on white. The corner did not have a discoloration to it. Um, it's an on-card auto. It's another card from 2012-13. Uh, graded 10 autograph. From 12-13. Select. Uh, Jim Mint. Kobe Bryant. Jersey auto. Real nice card not the prism just the regular uh, the regular base version um, the regular version or the I mean the prism version of this card um, I think I saw one sold for around 500 but it was again the prism version and I think it was ungraded so I imagine this one is probably around the same value um, surface is a nine, three nine, three nine five subgrades, and the surface got me a nine. The corner bend actually on the card is back on the back side, down on this corner over here, and uh, that was the reason why I didn't want to send it in. Is why I just always kept it in a magnetic holder. But it's a, as you can see, it's a white coloring on uh, with the white corners. So I don't know if they missed the corners or. From what I've heard from Beckett grading, they don't judge, they don't inspect the back of the card as much as they do the front. So most of the overall grade of the card comes from the front. So if you guys didn't know that about Beckett grading, most of the overall grade I'm pretty sure comes from the front of the card. So all the front corners, especially when you have a thicker card. Um, it comes from the front of the card rather than the back of the card um, but I'm not a hundred percent on that but that's just what I me and the guy that I submit these with have discussed um, in the past so this is a really good card I have one other uh, Kobe auto graded um, but it's only I think less than a nine and uh, this one is an on-card auto out of 199. Real nice card. Um, really, really happy. This is my favorite card out of the out of the all the all of them, out of all the ones that I picked up. Not the whole, not of all of them that I own, but of all of them from this submission here. So, <coughs> but yeah, that is it. So, hopefully, I have uh, hit your wow factor. Um, but uh, even with this SPX Gold, I'm really excited even though it only got a 9. You got the dual patch, um, the auto from Crusade, the Premier, prestigious Premiers, Giannis, and the Kyrie Irving uh, Rookie Auto out of 199 from Limited. And the auto for the Kobe is on the back got a 10 autograph on the back that's where they put that up because the title was too big to put on the front so all right hopefully uh, you'll get uh, a like hit a like button on this video because uh, five gym mints plus of mint is a pretty good overall uh, grade 
Um, I hope you guys enjoyed that. Stay tuned, subscribe, comment what you think on that video um, or on this video, and uh, be sure and sub stay tuned for more. I'm about to uh, to close this video off and actually open up all these packs. There's probably about 20 packs here, 20 to 24 packs of just miscellaneous stuff. <coughs> baseball football and basketball stay tuned for that uh, let me know, let me uh, let me know what you think of the cards and obviously uh, like I said at the beginning of the video if you're interested in seeing a top 10 overall or just a top 10 Jordan or whatever you know put it on the comment section I'm curious of what you guys think um, I've got quite a bit in my collection as far as graded cards go um, so yeah, I guess just uh, just whatever you whatever comes to mind, let me know. I'll review it. Um, thanks for watching. Um, I'm fixing to turn around and make this other video. Peace. See you next time.